Matt Somerville. Funny I would run into you here. Yeah, typically uh, we'd only come together for a demo night, but this is pretty fun. I had a good time. Officer Gibson today predicted that you would be on the podium if you did not uh, have troubles. So here we are. Yeah, thank goodness we stayed out of trouble. Uh, and the car was fast, as last week. I'm up here with good company, a couple of good guys, hard racers. Uh, I got to say thanks to all my sponsors, J2 Racing, SR Construction, Lulu Amy Cass, Central Welding, they always help out. Uh, my family and father-in-law for setting up that car. Uh, we were fast, Daryl Tiedemann for giving me this car to drive. It's an amazing opportunity. All right, let's hear it for Matt Somerville. <laughs> Quinn Borison, why don't you come on up? Let's make some noise for the one-armed bandit, Quinn Borison. What's up, Quinn? How you doing? Good. How are you? Doing well. So a fortunate yellow flag brings you up here tonight, but that's part of racing. You'll take it. You know, I'll take luck any time over being good. Well, I think you're good and and lucky. Yeah, sometimes. Yeah. Yeah. What, what else are we gonna talk about? Nice, nice rainy night here. Oh, geez, why did we have to get this stuff? My car was really good earlier, so. Um, I got to thank uh, Dave Brandenburg for working on this car so much and helping me out just, you know, the whole time. I mean, he's just right there for me and just any little thing I tell him, he fixes and makes it right and makes it good and it's just fun to drive. And then I got uh, Mrs. Turner's Hometown Cafe and Aldrich Excavating. I got Northwest Wine and Liquor, Gino's Pizza, Olympia Pizza, and, uh, you know, just so many people to thank down in the pits and everybody here for coming out and enduring this night. Gino's is always a good stop after races. All right, let's hear it for him. Quinn Borson. Thanks, man. All right, Mr. Cox. Tonight's winner, Steve Cox. Let's hear it for him. She's cuter than me. You should go see her first. Words hurt, though, Steve. That, that was kind of harsh. What's going on, Steve? That was a pretty fun race. That was an awesome race. I was going to just settle for third, and the skies opened up, as they call it. It was awesome. I, I, uh, you know, once again, got to thank uh, Tommy Gap for the use of his vehicle, his vehicular module. And, uh, and um, by the way, my brother is in from North Carolina. He's a uh, Joe Gibbs racing guy, so he's uh, just down here checking everybody out. So that's awesome to have him here. And uh, happy Father's Day to everybody out there. Do you, do you, as a proud father, uh, do you want to embarrass your wife that she had to cough up a thousand bucks the other day? Yeah, we should do that. So about eight years ago, my brother's son graduates from high school and, and some kid yells, I love you, mom. And my wife goes, Chrissy, adorable, right? She goes, oh, you know, honey, if you do that, I'll give you a G. And my son did not forget and he prevailed. He, uh, he said, I love you, mom, at graduation. And he is now a thousand bucks richer and Chrissy's broke and I'm lending her money. I told Steve earlier as a high school senior there's probably not a lot I wouldn't have done for a thousand bucks so yelling I love you mom is probably on the lower end. I believe you Ben. Yeah thank you. All right Steve Cox tonight's winner let's hear it once again for all these guys out here.